there's not a whole lot of standing around for them. Tolson takes one deep and bangs home another three. I'm telling you, man. Champs at the perimeter. So the arrows are going to do a lot of this cut and pass. The yeah. defense plays hard. T. Bolson can step in front of this one. Oh! Above the rim there. So Rodden's going to get it in, kick it up to Olsen. Olsen's going to swing it around to Raybine. They're looking underneath as Engstrom goes up deep. And just like that, Arrow's got the lead. Look at Engstrom just gobbling him up underneath. There's that outside inside game there we talked is. about as Rodden buries a three. I mean, like you talked about to me, the, the players are moving. There you go. Olsen does a good job of cutting to the rim. Uh, Raybine finds him. Great pass by Raybine. And Mars. Still looking there, you get a wide open shot here by Torgerson. There you go. It Good home. set right out of the timeout. I was looking at it like you know, as Torgerson goes back up for a second back three. To back. back to back and there bangs home a second one. That's the spark Watertown needed. And here. not only does that do that, but it brings the crowd back. Yeah, good it. job of uh, Arrows forcing the turnover here as uh, Rodden brings it up with a little hezzy and back to the line. Boom and one. And one. How do you not get excited to watch that young man play basketball? Wide Good open wide look open. for Olsen here. Good Banks that there. one home. Look at all the momentum here. We talked about it. And then Olsen. Your center official. Rodden's right going to drive to the basket again. And end oh, one. Gosh. Another one. Rodden is taking over this game. Delivery to Olsen who kicks it out to Rodden. And Rodden just misses. Oh, a good Great tip there. rebound by there. By Bochamp. By Bochamp. So uh, final score is going to be the Watertown Arrows 58. The Brookie Bobcats 47.